What's up people of the internet, I'm the big bold here with yet another video. In this video we'll be testing the Intel Celeron N2840 which is a CPU based on the silver mount architecture and part of the Bayer family of power efficient processors. It has two cores and two threads and it has a frequency of up to 2.58 GHz. The Celeron N2840 has the Intel HD graphics page rail as the integrated graphics, which have 4 unified shaders and a frequency of up to 700 in H2 MHz in the N2840's case. It's also based on the Intel HD 4000's architecture, while using the latest drivers for it available. You also have 4GB of RAM in single channel mode, as well as a 500GB hard drive for the operating system and also in which the game is installed. As for operating system, we're using Windows XL Optimum 10 Pro version 2. You can find the full description of the specs in the video description down below. The game that we'll be benchmarking today is Hello Neighbor 1. Shout out to the guy who requested it, we're gonna be running the memory duct up before watching the game and I've set it to clean the RAM whilst usage reaches 90%. And let's get straight to the points now.
The game is actually playable in my opinion on this Celeron, but if you want more FPS, you can lower the resolution of the game below the lowest one allowed by default by going to the config file of the game, which is located in Users, App Data, Local, Hello Neighbor, Saved, Config, Windows No Editor. Open the game user settings.ini file with Notepad. In it, scroll down to the scalability groups where you should find the resolution quality value. If you lower it down from whatever it is set to, to 25 for example, make sure it's followed by dot and six zeros, you can get some more FPS on your horrible PC at the price of turning Hello Neighbor into Hello Blindness.